All right, so today I'm going to put these stickers, these Halloween stickers on my blue glittered cup. So I've got this cup here covered in blue glitter. Let me see, what color glitter did I use? Okay, what I did was I spray painted this cup with a blue spray paint, and then I used a hacked glitter over the top of it. That's what I did. So now this cup has had another layer of epoxy over the glitter. So it's pretty smooth. Before you put any stickers or vinyl, anything on top of your glittered cups, you wanna make sure that they're really smooth or else you will see the bumps through the sticker or vinyl. So I am gonna sand this real quick and then wash it off with some Dawn dish soap and water and then it'll be really smooth. I'm gonna use this sanding block. I don't know what the grit is, but it's pretty small. It's a little bit rough up here. Okay, so now the cup is washed and I'm just gonna dry it off a little bit more with a paper towel. All right, and now I'm gonna put the decals on. Okay, so I'm just gonna randomly place these all over the cup. Okay, so let me cut that out. Okay, so they are clear. Okay, so I'm gonna actually cut this closer around in case any of the clear part of it shows under epoxy. I want it to be pretty nice looking, not a weird shape. Okay. So now I'm gonna carefully, carefully try to pull it up here. Oh my gosh. There we go. And I'm just gonna put that right here in the middle. Cute. I like this cute little ghost. I think I might want to do something where I have the this right here and then the ghost kind of coming up from under it so I'm gonna do that right there and then I'm gonna put this one under that These are pretty easy to use. Okay, now I'm gonna put this little grave stone right here. All right, this bat is cute. Cute little bat. I have my window open up here, so there's a lot of people talking, a lot of noise from outside. Okay, I'm gonna 
do the bat little crooked here, a little sideways. So I'm just gonna fill this cup randomly, you know, just put them wherever. So I don't know if I mentioned it in this video, but I got these, I got these decals from theglitterguy.com. It's my absolute favorite place to buy anything glitter, tumbler related. So that's where I got them. And these are awesome. I've never used anything like this before because they, I believe they just started selling them somewhat recently, I guess like in the last six months or so. So this is my first time trying them out and they're really great to work with. So next I'm gonna do this little cauldron. Oh. By the way, this sheet is called Pastel Goth, <laughs> in case anybody wants to order it. I'm gonna put that right in the middle there. Ooh, we got a little bubble in it. Okay, I'm going to try to get that out as much as I can. It's because I put it right on the edge where it's the size of the cup was changing right there. So I should have been a little bit more careful, but I don't think that's going to be very visible in the end result of the cup. So it will. Okay, so during that recording, that last recording, my phone turned off because it said my storage was full. So I don't know yet what all was missed, but here's what the cup looks like now. Put a bunch of decals just all over it. And then I put one on the bottom as well. So what I'm gonna do now is let these decals adhere, um, fully adhere for the next couple hours or at least maybe overnight. And then I'm going to spray them with clear matte spray paint because that helps the epoxy to stick properly. I don't know at this moment, I've never used these before, so I don't know if the epoxy would repel off of these stickers or if it would be just fine. But either way, I'm just gonna not risk it. I'm gonna spray it with the matte spray paint. So this cup is now finished, completely smooth, completely ready, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.